what's up big freaks it's coach eva it's time for lifting as you see a different background behind us because it's all relocation right now so you will see a different setup right now but dumbbells are here on the side so make sure you have dumbbells with you because we're going to be doing some lifting but before we start i want us to warm up so we're going to get the bands that are on the side there we i see you guys joining welcome we're going to be doing some uh, rotation of our shoulders, warm up of the shoulders, and that's how we're going to start. We're going to implement some lower body exercise. So let's go. Guys, you ready? Let's go. It's a very light bend, guys. This, this should not be anything heavy. This should be nice and light so you can get that shoulder going, right? So we're going to start with keeping that shoulder at 90 degrees. And we're going to just close the doors. I, ca I call this closing the door technique, right? We want that arm 90 degrees, shoulders back, chest is out. I want the full control reel with the shoulder. Now, we're going to switch. And let's do the other side. So remember that elbow is tucked in. The rotation comes from the shoulder. You're keeping that wrist straight in line with your forearm. You're not letting that wrist rotation. You're trying to keep that 90 degree angle with your arm and you just do a few repetitions. Now, stay with me, switching the arm. Don't switch and rotate yourself. Now we're gonna open the door. So look, this is the point that a lot of people will go like this and try to twist that hand. No, that hand has to be straight. You wanna keep that shoulder right here, all arm 90 degrees. Knees are slightly bent and try to keep the elbow close towards the side and switch shoulders back just as out we opening up right now the other side that we're going to be doing some other form of stretching so let's do this a few times keep that 90 degree angle right here and let it go for a second i want you to go in and out like this loosen up the shoulders crisscross in front of you and then really pull your shoulder blades together Deep breath in and exhale. Now go up and down as well. Let's see how this shoulder is feeling here. If you can go through full range of motion, all the way up and down. Good, back to your bend. Now again, this is a light bend, guys. This is a light bend. We're gonna bring those arms up. We like that stretch right here. And we're gonna create a 90 degree angle. Now, right here, this is important, 90. Because now this shoulder is going this way, look. We're not moving the whole arm. It's just going towards the floor, down. Now you can stay right here with me, slightly bent. Bring that hand down, full control, squeeze it, and switch, other side. Always check your posture, shoulder blades down, take a deep breath in, and exhale. So we try not to raise up the shoulders. We try to keep the shoulder elbow 90 degree angle this is remember this is just a warm-up so really light bend few reps and let's switch loosen up now we're stepping back where we're facing the bend we're gonna pull right here to 90 degrees so the elbow is in line with your shoulder and now we're gonna bring that arm up breathe out each time deep breath in and exhale and again it's such a small movement Breathe out, don't hold the breath. And switch, loosen up the other arm. First, pull it, roll it, bring it up. So the opposite movement of what we just did. And bring it down. Now we're gonna reach down towards the floor. I want you to loosen up that back. Loosen up your shoulders, reach down towards the floor, come up and extend through the hips deep breath in and exhale overhead deep breath in and exhale now the goal here is not to round your spine like this try to lower yourself down and open up that chest still so don't round your back but it comes with the flexibility right we want to engage those hamstrings stretch them actively preparing for the motion now bring your hands behind your head we're gonna do a squat okay prisoner squat 
prisoner squat right here. So body weight, pump those legs for me, few squats, and then we're gonna stretch those squats. Deep breath in and exhale. Remember, when you're breathing in and out, beginning of the movement and then, then the end of the movement, right? Elbows are open, hands behind your head. You get into a 90 degree angle squat. You gotta warm up the legs too, not just your upper body. That's very important and time. So we're gonna do a walking quad stretch, guys. Let's do it. Walking quad stretch, so two, three seconds. You can hold on to something, hold for a second, get that balance going. Stretch your quad, step forward. Stretch the other leg, step forward. And now as we go, go back, we're gonna reach for your toes and actively stretch the hamstrings, right? Just like this, deep breath in and exhale, and step back. Deep breath in and exhale. Now we're gonna step forward and do a knee hack. So you're gonna pull that knee up and hold for a second. Take a deep breath in and exhale. And again, take a deep breath in. So the knee comes towards the chest, not the other way around, right? You can walk, you can move around. Yes, all right, let's hit a few jacks. So jumping jacks, guys, how they should be done. All the way up with your arms. All the way up, not just here. I've seen those, those are not jacks. I'm not sure what it is, but this is not a jumping jack. Arms going way overhead, you're jumping on the ball of your feet. Light on your feet, warm up the whole body. Jumping jacks are great. And time. So, you don't have a stability ball like we do. No problem. You're gonna lay down on the floor for a first one. And then we're gonna pick up the motion and go. So get your dumbbells ready. In case you want this one. This one has these spikes. But it has more air. Get your Dumbbells ready and let's do it as chest press. And as you see, we have an incline set up. But if you do not have an incline, you can go on the incline on the ball if you want to. All right, so we're gonna start with a medium size. We're not going all the way heavy. We want to kind of warm up the body with the motions. We're gonna be going about 15 to 20 reps. 15 to 20 reps, am I visible? On Instagram, you're not. On oh, Facebook, I'm not. I'm gonna move this towards the other direction. I'm gonna go this way. All right, guys. So look, sit on that ball. This is how you start. And then you roll yourself. Head and shoulders on the ball, 90 degree angle, chest is out, hips are up, and we are gonna go right here. Control motion on that ball. Now ball is great because it's gonna activate the glutes because it's not like on the bench, you gotta hold yourself up. And again, 15 to, really 20 to 25. We wanna go really high numbers. Keep on pressing, guys, above your chest. We're gonna get warm up and warm really quick. I already feel it. And time. Keep those dumbbells handy. We're gonna go into a body weight squat, first one. And the second one, we're gonna add some dumbbells. So let's do this. Squatting, go, go, go. Deep breath in and exhale. Now, we do this first round with no dumbbells, but if you feel up for it and get some like dumbbell, go ahead. But the first one we just doing body weight. And again, Look what I told you, how I'm teaching you. You're squatting, you're pushing your hips back, right? Hips back. Like this, he's going. He's going, pushing his hips back. On an invisible chair, back is straight. So don't do this. Keep yourself open. Look straight ahead. 
knees staying in line with your ankles. You're dropping those hips back on a visible chair. Fine. Get into your incline right away. Go, Tysi, go. If you want a higher number right now, go a little heavier, go, because that's how you're going to increase the calories burned. You want to be on the higher or lower? This, is, this one is a little bit lower. This one? This one, mine. Are you okay there? Yeah. Okay. Don't try. We can always switch. Ready, guys? Let's do this. Chest is open. Abs are tight. Glutes are tight. We are pumping. You're going to stay with us for a full 60 minutes. Because this is 60 minutes of lifting. It's Monday. Now. The dumbbells work on the way up and on the way down. You feel the resistance, so don't just flop around. Don't go like fast and try to swing it. No. Control right here. Keep going, we're going. Breathe. Remember what I told you about 20 to 25 reps. Ah, good work. Deadlifts, if you have just a dumbbell, go for it. But if you have kettlebell like we have, we're going to be doing some deadlifts. You can do the same motion with just one dumbbell, guys. So that lift is pulling the motion. So look, it's not squat. I'm leaning forward. I'm pushing my hips back right here, abs and glutes tight. Come and now that. you're extending through the hips. Come on that, you could be hitting. Huh? Oh. Come on that, back one. Oh. Yeah, go, go, go. Now, activation, glutes, hamstrings, hips, right here. So look, I'm hinging forward. My back is neutral, natural. I'm not, I'm not rounding like this. This is wrong. Please do not do that. Shoulders back, lean forward, right here. Legs should be shoulder with a bar. If you're really tall, it can go a little bit wider. Engagement right here, hamstrings and glutes. It's okay, me too. Lean forward again. Abs and glutes tight. Squeeze your back. Okay, listen, if you go for 25, go ahead, go for 25. I'm stripping down. Stripping down. Clothes coming off. Get ready. All right, now lunges. So we're gonna be walking lunges. So what I want from you is stepping forward and walking. Stepping forward and walking. Now, if you do not have enough space, just step forward and push back. However, maybe you have a whole way. 
So let's do this. Me and Tyson's going to be walking around with this lunging, going back and forth. Let's do this, guys. Step. And then if you have to reset yourself in the center, fine. And step. Just walking on, just I see. Walking on, just coming to the camera. Now he's doing body weight and this is totally fine. He's modifying. You don't need to have a weight in your hands if this is too difficult for you, okay? The walking lunges are awesome for your hamstring squats, glutes. Excellent, excellent workout. You can step forward, you can reset in the center, whatever works, right? Keep on going, guys. We turn around a few times just to be visible. And time. Now, high plank position, and we're gonna pump the renegade roll. What's your plan high plank roll? So we move from press to pull, push to pull. We are right here. I wanna make sure that Facebook is seeing me. Let's do Facebook now, right here. Facebook is seeing us right here. Let's go, guys. So now, because you're pulling a weight, we need to stay a little bit wider. Don't bring your feet together because you're gonna be wobbling and moving. We want stable base right here. We're gonna roll it. Now, I don't wanna hear no dumbbells. Like, kaboom, down, no. Quiet. too heavy if you have a back problem go a little lighter get that motion going okay we haven't done those in a while feels good oh my god Shoulders back, chest is out. 
we're gonna rotate right regular and then press right here so dumbbells up press it overhead right to the shoulder unfold them squeeze them elbows tucked into the side full control with the motion deep breath in and exhale so you don't want to hold the breath that's a common mistake Try not to wobble your body front and back. Oh yeah, break is coming up after this. We're going to get water, drink our pre-workout. Again. And please write it down where you're coming from, where you guys coming from. And let us know if you've been doing this workout with us. If you have ever done a workout with us. This is your first time and time. Yes, guys, we're going to feel this in our shoulders because we were moving so much stuff Woo. for the past few days. We've been moving things around. So, my pre-workout concoction, what's in yours? Somebody took it, took mine. Somebody took my muscle building block hey. concoction. Give it back. Give it back. Sure it has to be in there. Wellness shot it is. You should hear me sneezing. When you take a wellness shot, you sneeze that the whole house, the whole foundation is like uh, uh, shaking. That's the sneeze. That's what clears you feel much better. Yes, and it's very tangy. Super duper concoction to build the hook muscles. Are we ready? Chop, chop. We gotta move. We're going again. I want you to increase your weight if you have. Listen, you, we're gonna say stop, but you just keep on pounding, okay? Tyson, where are you? That's what we're gonna do. So, remember, sit on the ball, sit on the ball, roll yourself out, pay attention to the cues, oh, hips up. Head on the ball, make sure that the chin away from your chest. There is not real motion and we are pushing away. Going 
above and beyond just to be his mom. Look at that. So now he's paying the price. It's okay. It's going to be fine. You just need to stretch a little bit more. Did I and, beat you with every jump? Uh, yes. Press. You like did. <laughs> Bench press. You did. Bench press the whale. That was the challenge that we did. Pump it up, guys, and stay with us because we're going to have some cool challenges coming up. If you want to join us and do the next one, let us know. Uh. Activate those glutes. Activate those hamstrings right now for me, please. Don't lock your knees when you're standing up. It's all about extension and squeezing the muscles, quads, hamstrings, right? But don't lock your knees. Time. Now we're going right into an incline. So get your dumbbells, whatever that was. Uh, nice to be careful when you're lifting because when you lift from the ground, this is the deadlift motion. Yeah. All right. All right, don't, don't, don't go crazy. <laughs> oh gosh. Funny boy. Uh. Whoa. Do it, do it, do it. Come on, everybody. Look up at the sky, don't look here. Chin away from your chest. I want that good, strong arms there. Your abs support the motion, so make sure you're squeezing them. noises. Alright, I'm gonna do 20. 
even though hip, hip, hip flexors always like bother me with this one. All right, cameras down on the floor, face down on the floor. We are rolling. I don't see you in the camera, guys. Uh, no, well, Facebook sees you. All right, friends, let's go. Ah. You remember what I told you? You gotta stay wider, right? Wider, wider base. So you try to stay as flat as possible. You don't wanna twist your hips. Your hands should go directly underneath the shoulders. And the dumbbell should hit the ground very gently and slowly. There should be no pounding on it, okay? Oof. I'm lifting. We need to struggle a little bit, okay? you can feel that one ah feels good awesome all right now bend over roll so we're gonna stay in that position rolling 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 as you go bend over I'm gonna get your 20 Get lighter one for the bend over. Oh, that's actually bad. Oh, this standing, yes, bent. Yeah. All right, we are here. Let's do it. Now remember, reset if you have to. Reset if you have to. Shoulders back, you're raising your shoulders, sexy. Don't, don't bring them forward. They stay back. Yes. the camera a little bit. Right. My head will be gone. Look. <laughs> Look at this. Facebook. 
Her is her is. Yes, we are not fine. And down. Remember what I told you. This is alternating. So we're going left, right, left, down, right, down. Now right, left, right, down, left, down. Now left, right, left, and right. Right, left, right, and left. But remember, if you cannot get this motion, it confuses you too much. It's coordination. Then just stick to the same leg. And do the next one, next round. There is always a way out of every situation. Issues, you can just totally sit down and do the same exercise sitting down so you get the extra support. cool guys this bottle is super amazing I drink about three of those a day hot days about four four even and a half remember stay hydrated that's what's gonna boost your metabolism and help you burn the fat of course don't think that just drinking water will burn the fat because it doesn't work like this if you eating crap and you're not eating you are starving that's gonna have the opposite effect on you. You're gonna be gaining weight. Oh yeah, some of you probably been trying to decrease your calories intake and starve and not eat enough. And then you are like, wait a second, I look bigger than ever. How is how come it's like this? That's exactly how it is, because you're starving your body and your body does not like this. So stop starving, contact us and we'll help you out. All right, we're going back again. Just loosen up those arms, loosen up those shoulders. If something stays, see I was doing stretching, I was doing hamstring, quads, whatever. You wanna lay down on the floor, open up your chest, loosen up, fine, go for it. Cause this is, a, those are those rounds are pretty long, right? We're going straight through uh, without any break. That's the moment that we just pick up the dumbbells. All right, going. Round number three. We gotta move. I gotta make some room here. Make some room. And you are going 
because it's time for you. I have 25 here. I am on the ball, so I am going to stick with the 25. I'm not gonna get the heavier one because of the lower back. This is totally fine. Hold on here. Hmm? Hold on again. I'm just doing this one. All right, get the ball ties. Set her up for an incline. We're gonna go with the press. Sit firmly on the ball. Dumbbells on your hands right here, resting on your quads. And you're gonna walk out and do the press. Make sure that you are good, set, and go. Feet are away, chin away. Open chest. Squeeze those glutes, they support you, don't sink down. S should be on fire after 20 reps. Don't sink down on me. I'm holding the 25. Go for heavier, go for heavier. Remember, if you go in for heavier, I'm expecting you to have absolutely great posture. Now, the upper body in between your shoulder blades is the one that will want to crunch forward and round your back. And you cannot allow this because if you have a weight in front of you, that's natural way of your body to like curve forward, but you gotta keep that chest open. Okay, keep that chest open, my friends. Deep breath in and exhale. Now guys, amazing new opportunity for so many of you that have never tried the online sessions with us. I'm busy working out with you, but there is more to it. It's called the Mind, Body and Business peak performance coaching group. It's all about the performance, guys. So this is a new program that only takes people that are serious. So if you are serious, if you wanna change in all different areas of your life, like mind, body, business, this program is for you. We do one-on-one -on -one coaching with very intense work or we do group coaching. Whichever one you prefer, contact us and let us know because your whole life will be scheduled and put it into work. You're gonna be also put it into the test. Oh, oh no, she looks cute. cute. Yes, you we're gonna take her in. She will take. We will take her in. Yes. Hey. All right. Just, just don't disturb. Let's go incline. So now, Elonka, chest. All right. Right there, honey. Get your light dumbbells. I want you to do the chest press on the floor. Chest press on the floor. Incline. There is no destruction, okay? I'm taking you in under one condition. There is no destruction. If there is a destruction, there is a removal from the scene. Ah. Incline. You don't have an incline. I don't I can do chest press on the floor, so grab some light dumbbells. Ah! Uh oh. Incline, go. <laughs> go, 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 go. Always step away from above your chest, honey, not above your head, okay? Above your chest. We are going. We are not stopping till the whole group is done, okay? Thank you, Dumbo. 
Shoulders back, knees bent. You're raising your shoulders. Shoulders back and down. Oh, there you go, like this. There you go, like that. Now roll it a little bit all the way back. You, you did it good. Yes, like that. today. So if you have a stability ball, that's going to be great. Slow and control motion. Tyson is going a little faster because he doesn't have the dumbbells. So this is okay. Now, 
both the press, guys. Curl to press. Curl to press. Shoulders back, chest is out. And let's do this. Please step away. I have dumbbells in my hands. Ah. We are curling and pressing. He's going, you don't need to do that. He's doing it from his back, okay? Oh. Knees are slightly bent, guys. Pump it up. Few more, few more. I know everybody are tired. You should be tired after working so hard today. Easier it is. 
less of the feet going above. You're gonna go like this with your feet, and you're gonna stay with the ball of your feet on the ball. That's gonna be super hard. Hands underneath the shoulders. Hold it. I wanna see it. Stay away from any equipment because this is danger. Hands tight. Push tight. Hold it. Ah. Time. Flip over. Lay down on your back. like me. Oh, no, okay. stop it! <laughs> I can't wait. You've been forbidden. <laughs> what forbidden. Instagram knows you. Thank you, Instagram! All right. Guys, listen up. As I mentioned to you before, please, if you struggle with your weight, this is not only about your weight. This is not just a simple issue. If you've been gaining and losing over the course of, course of years and you find yourself unhappy, 
this is more than just this so we gotta look into this and what you need is either one-on-one -on -one mind body coaching or you need <laughs> oh the kids or you need a group accountability coaching that will change your life so thank you guys for joining us today high five Jovic. that's what i always do who's gonna say high five who's gonna say no excuses high five are you guys gonna say no excuses no excuses no i'm gonna say no excuses like really loud yeah. people yes, you guys yes, too, yes. with the chaos that it's happening here at the Eckert family yes, yes. Bye.